Good morning. I hope everybody is having a beautiful morning. Today is Monday, March 2nd. Yay, we're in March 2020. The year is already going very fast. Um, so, update. I don't think I've slept a good night in a week. My eyes are puffy. They feel like I have sand in them. Um, I went to the gym this morning and I walked and I didn't do as much as I wanted to, but that's okay too. Sometimes you gotta let go of the high expectations that you set for yourself and allow yourself to be okay with what you can do at the time. Um, the stress of the particular situation I am in is starting to really get to me. And so I had a wonderful talk with a very, very dear friend of mine yesterday. And I was able to finally have a talk with my partner a little bit about it. And we've, we're, we're all in agreement. <laughs> it's just a matter of having a conversation. So, um, today's theme or daily devotional affirmation is I release the past with love. I choose to voice only love. I thought that was, this was a really good one because it kind of sums up, you know, my current situation. I'm looking for lip balm. It's my lips are killing me. Okay. Um, I thought it was really appropriate because I have anxiety and fear about um, certain situations. And in the past, I get this weird selective mutism that kicks in and I run away. <laughs> and the funny part is, is it's, it's not really based in fear. It's based in anxiety and guilt and shame and uh, apprehension. Um, fear is part of that, yes, but I don't mean like I'm afraid of a confrontation. I have had confrontations my whole life. Confrontations don't scare me. I don't like them. I don't think anybody likes them. I don't seek them out, but there are situations that I have developed in my life that I have this weird and it's, it goes back all the way back, all the way back. Um, I remember that there was a time that there were certain questions people would ask me and I would just get quiet. And I was in my 20s and 30s before I was able to talk about those things. It's, a, it's selective mutism and I don't, it's all wrapped up in uh, emotions and internal responses and this affirmation, being able to release the past, release those situations um, with love and know that those are those situations are just part of how I function. I, I don't have a, uh, I don't have an explanation really other than they just happen. And I choose, I choose to voice only love and I love that part of today's affirmation. I choose to voice only love. So I'm going to use that as a tool in my current situation because if I can if I can overcome this particular selective mutism about this particular situation, then maybe I can overcome it and work through it so I can sleep at night. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's really interesting. I don't get really insomnia a whole lot. Um, I, you know, when, when I was really sick with biotoxin, it was pretty common for me to run into people and go, oh, I bet you don't sleep at all. And that's one of the symptoms with my biotoxin I've never really had. I, I'm usually somebody, my head hits the pillow and I choose to go to sleep and I am out. Um, but the this, this anxiety and the stress of the last week, two weeks, three weeks, it's been building over a period of time, <laughs> has um, made it very difficult for me to sleep. 
So, you know, I'm not exempt from life happening and and these affirmations really help me. So I'm gonna work today. It's, I'm actually writing it on another piece of paper. I release the past with love. I choose to voice only love. And I'm hoping that today's affirmation will also help me with a very difficult conversation that I have to have and move a situation forward in a positive, um, loving, kind, and compassionate manner. And, um, so that's today's daily devotion. I will see you tomorrow in prayer. Blessed be.